Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, in this video, we're going to talk about another reseller. Yep, we're going to talk about her. That's what we're going to do. You're going to see why. It's gossip time. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, we are going to be talking about Farm Girl Scavenger Noel, but we're not talking about her. Well, we might talk about her a little bit, but we're going to be talking about her bolo. She is a big money bolo finder and she sells the weird. That is like her thing to sell the weird. So I messaged her today and I'm like, hey, get in your July bolos. And I said, if you want to share extra, I'll feature you in a video. So she shared some extra because she's extra. And here we go. This is the Facebook group, Share Your Best July Bolo. And she went in and she shared a bunch. So now I'm going to share them with you so you can learn. But definitely go and follow Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. Um, <coughs> excuse me. This is her eBay. She's also on YouTube as Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. And she has so much bolo content over there. And she is a mega bolo finder. I mean, she knows how to source. So check her out. She sells very random, weird things for big money. And she's not afraid to price high and wait on the right buyer. So let's see what she has to say. She always has the best post because um, she really just says what she thinks. Here we go. Sorry, Courtney Bolo Buddies. I'm a last minute person. Always late to the party, but I just, I'm just going to blast a bunch of stuff because why not? So this is actually from the very last day of June. Don't come for me because <laughs> this is the July post. Um, I paid a dollar for this and it sold on a 25% off sale for $41.99. They were all in for $52.40, all in shipped. All I have to say here is mushrooms. So you guys, this is a roll of self-adhesive mushroom paper. Yep, $41.99. Would you have walked past it or would you have picked it up? And if you would have listed it, would you have listed it for $44.24? Let me know in the comments. All right. The next one, Onsen Anti-Wrinkle BioCell Lift Facial Mask Instant Skin Firming Solution. One ounce. Pick this up in an estate sale for about $2. This is a discontinued item sold, for, sold on a 25% off sale for $95.98. They were all in for $110.56 shipped. Discounted beauty products can sell for amazing money. I will caution everyone, though. Some brands will Vero you. So do your homework. You cannot sell open containers of anything, period, end of discussion on eBay. <laughs> so yes, the item has to be new and unused if it is cosmetics or perfume. Um, that's so funny. Good job, Noelle. And uh, this is a new old stock item. So definitely discontinued items can sell. But what she's saying is a uh, Vero is um, verified rights owner. They, a lot of items, not a lot, but there are items that certain companies will come after you if you sell their items. So be careful with that is what she's saying. This is a vintage Royal Canadian Artillery cap badge, World War II, World War II, the other way written, lugs and pin original. One thing I want you to focus on also when you're watching this is look at her titles. Um, she's been reselling a long time. She has a great eye for um, vintage and cool items. Not everything sells for crazy big money, but she may list something that you would walk past. This is pretty cool, and I got it for free when I helped do a storage clean out. I sold on offer to watchers for $28.98. All in shipped $35.87. Do don't discount these old pins. They can bring some serious money. This is what I call man jewelry. <laughs> That's an old one. Look at the back of it. All right, here we go with the next one. Vintage 1995 Fitz and Floyd Bustles and Boas Figural Anthropomorphic Cookie Jar. Okay, little bunny rabbits with faces. Fitz and Floyd, there is money to be made here, but make no mistake, you must look items up because many simply have no value and they were overproduced. Now, with that being said, I went to an estate sale last day. It was a Sunday afternoon and the lady whose estate it was, was Fitz and Floyd dealer as well as Yodro. 
And the company had priced the items so high that nobody was buying them. She also had many Royal Dalton figures. I can tell you that I bought it all. I also got all her dealer books as well. I had to drive back home and get boxes and wrapping paper. They had to close off half of a room for everything I got. Even Mindful Recycle was going to go, but she messaged me and asked if I was going. And I think I told her I was there and I had bought everything. <laughs> Why did I buy everything, you ask? Because it was all vintage and retired pieces and I got some amazing pieces. It took me over a year to get them listed due to moving. This piece sold on a 25% off sale for $91.73. They were all in for $124.28 shipped. I got amazing feedback. So always comp your Fitz and Floyd. Okay, she men mentioned Mindful Recycle. And Mindful Recycle is another amazing YouTube channel. I don't, I haven't checked lately, but the last I knew she's not putting out content. But you guys, it would be worth it to go and watch some of her old videos because she is a mega bolo finder, just like Noelle really, really finds the good stuff. And they both do a lot of estate sales. So definitely check out Mindful Recycle as well. Patience Brewster McKenzie Child's Dashaway Mini Cupid Reindeer Brooch Pin. This is a brooch. Did you know that McKenzie Child's owns the Patience Brewster brand? Neither did I, but I do now. So this little brooch is adorable. Paid a dollar for it at an estate sale. They did not know what it was, and I did. I love me some Patience Brewster. Definitely a brand to research and know. Sold for $31.23 on a 25% off sale. $38.26 all in shipped. Yep. Very cool. Patience Brewster. This, here you go. Not a huge bolo, but these do sell and usually quick, fairly quick. These took about three years, but you know, list it and forget it. Yep. That's what I say. Sold for full asking price of $33.98 and they were all in for $53.15. So this is a Conair Extreme Instant Heat Multi-Size Hot Rollers, 20 rollers and heated clips. I did hear that a lot of the hot rollers do really well on Poshmark. I don't know that for sure. I think I read it in like a Facebook post or somebody wrote it. I don't know. I read it somewhere, somewhere at some point in time. I remember that. But uh, so cross post your items like this to uh, Poshmark. And if you're not, cro if you are not cross posting, definitely, definitely consider it because more platforms, more eyes on your items. And a lot of people on Poshmark and Mercari, they are part-time sellers and they will use their credits instead of cashing out the money to shop. So those buyers are not on eBay. All right. I use List Perfectly. Um, I've been using it since 2019. I've always been on the business plan. And I recently switched to the pro plan and opted into the pro plus plan because they have a new thing called listing assistant. They also have the auto delist and a lot of new features that they didn't have before. And I finally said, I'm doing it. I'm going to start my items on List Perfectly and I'm going to get all my items on those platforms at the same time instead of starting on eBay and waiting to list to the other platforms, okay? So check out my video, Starting Over, Bolo Buddies Starting Over into the YouTube search and Bolo Buddies Listing Assistant and see what you guys think. And if you decide if you wanna try List Perfectly, coupon referral code Bolo Buddies, all one word, lowercase, use the link below, that's my referral link, and you'll get 30% off your first month. You will also get 30% off if you are upgrading. So if you're upgrading to a plan that you have never used before, you can get the 30% off. So when I upgraded from business to pro, I had never been on pro, so I used it. I used a code and got 30% off. Because of course I'm gonna use a code and get 30% off, right? So anyway, check those videos out. I'll link them down below. Definitely a game changer. And I'm super excited for these new changes that I'm going to implement into my business to make it better. All right. So let me know what you think. And if you're going to try it, this one, absolutely love this one. This is exactly the type of thing I would expect Farm Girl Scavenger Noel to sell. It is a Baxter Lane Co. El Paso, Texas Sunland Vintage Travel Luggage Water decal sticker. Yes, it's a sticker, guys. She said, I feel I have shared similar items before. I paid 10 cents for this, purchased a large lot of these the very last day of a three-week long estate sale. This particular one sold for 25 on a best offer and we're all in for 30, 15 shipped. Not too bad for a little window decal sticker, don't you think? I really do think. 
<laughs> That's awesome. This is a vintage baby Dior cotton baby blanket, pink bow, white eyelet lace. And you know what this makes me think of? This makes me think of the blanket that Noelle stole from me on Whatnot from Catfield and Thrifty. All right, she didn't really steal it from me. I was too cheap. I stopped bidding and she kept bidding and I bet it's in her eBay store. And it is one of the most amazing baby blankets ever. And um, she bought it from Catfield and Thrifty on Whatnot. You guys, if you're not on Whatnot, you can definitely source on Whatnot. Um, I'm Bolo Buddies over there. Farm Girl Scavenger Noelle's over there. Catfield and Thrifty. Check us all out. Um, so Catfield and Thrifty was doing a, what do you call it? A this and that type show where it was a bunch of vintage stuff. I bought a bunch of stuff and I did a video of everything I bought and I've already sold items and made a nice profit. So you can source, uh, $15 to shop with my referral link. If you want to join whatnot down below and come follow all three of us. Now she said, let's talk about vintage baby blankets. I really don't want to give too much info out because I can't give away everything. But let's just say, if you know, you know. I paid a dollar for this at an estate sale. And let me tell you, Noelle is an open book. So she's just kidding when she says um, she can't tell you all her secrets. Because if you watch her YouTube channel, she tells you all her secrets. I think. Unless she's holding out. And I don't know about it. But anyway, she tells you a lot. Uh, let's see. Paid a dollar for this at an estate sale because obviously they did not know. Sold for $66.73 on a 25% off sale, $79.05 ship. The buyer sent amazing feedback. Memories, this is what the feedback said. Memories of my children's childhood. Baby Dior was all the rage in the 80s and so glad to be able to find one in good condition all these years later. I always say that I'm in the business of selling memories and this just proves that maybe just maybe I am, right? So she sold this to somebody who it was nostalgic. It brought back memories. Okay. That's what's great about vintage. These are just simply beautiful. I purchased these last summer at an estate sale in Salem, Oregon, about an hour drive. I probably should have separated these and sold the bowl separately, but I didn't. Paid 10 for the set. Again, they did not know what they had and neither did the other reseller that was with me. Uh, so she paid 10 I took a best offer of $222 and they were all in for $261.32 shipped. Hudson Beach Glass is a thing. Trust me, I wouldn't steer you wrong. Hudson Beach Glass. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. Wonder how, is there a marking? I don't even see a marking. See, she just knows. And Noelle has a really good memory. Like she remembers things. So uh, yeah, that's great. This is a Costa Boda Noel of the Year 2010 Red Gold Santa Paperweight. Anna, or, or, I don't know how to say her last name. We're just going to say, you can read it. Oh, Costa Boda, how do I love you? Again, a case of they didn't know what they had. Tons of collectible Christmas, you name it. Again, her grandson and her, she and her grandson ran into Mindful Recycle. She said, I love Terry and she is just an amazing person. And she is an amazing person. Terry's fabulous. Uh, Mindful Recycle. Again, go check her out, guys. This was sitting. Actually, go watch a video and tell her she needs to come back. Say, come back to YouTube. You guys, so much education there. This was sitting in its box in a corner and I saw it and about passed out. I knew what it was. I scooped it up, paid five gladly for it, sold in 10 days. Sadly, fell into a 30% off sale, but still got $244.99 for it. And they were all in for $278.16. All in shipped. Keep your eyes open for these tree-shaped paperweights. Very few still have the box. By the way, just head on over to Replacements LTD and you can look all of them. Look at all of them. Um, let's see. Okay, here we go. Uh, let's look at it. Oh, it's so cute. It's Santa. Wow. Okay, see the little sticker on it, you guys? Hold on right here. Right there, a little sticker. Or is that etched in? I think it's a sticker. So Costa Boda. Boda? Costa? I'm probably saying it wrong. Harry Potter. Free to me. Oh, Harry, Harry Potter. Helped set up an estate sale and got a bunch of ornaments. This was one. It sold 30% off sale for 119. They were all in for 137.50 shipped and feedback was received. Harry Potter playing uh, Quidditch. 
Cudich? I don't know what that is. Ornament. Oh, I quit. I'm not reading all that. Kurt Adler. That's good, right? Good. You guys got it. Read the title. <laughs> and last but not least, can you guess? Yep. You know it. Tupperware for the win. Welcome to the winner's circle. Laugh out loud. Sorry, not sorry. I just can't help myself. I really have to start making videos again. Okay. These tiny little salt and pepper shakers are about four and a half inches tall and they are a bolo. The lady who bought them from me actually sent me a message and asked if they were real. Seriously? Well, I do they make vintage, do they make Tupperware that's not real? I'm so confused. Well, she paid $34.29 and 30% off sale as well as $43.27 ship. Paid 10 cents for them. Notice in the title, I have every part number. I have a link to the Tupperware parts catalog and my Tupperware video if anyone wants to have it. So follow me on all the places, YouTube, Instagram, and even have Farm Girl Scavenger Facebook page. Hope everyone is having amazing sales and finding amazing items out here. Courtney Bolo Buddies, you are the bestest. Oh, thanks, Noelle. Uh, you guys, Noelle sells Tupperware. I give her a hard time because I think Tupperware is boring. But um, she has obviously taught me that even if it's boring, it sells. So let me just show you some of her other Tupperware solds right here. Spoons, utensils. Look at this little thing. It's a keychain. What's this? A mini salt and pepper shaker. It's for your pocket. I mean, because everybody needs salt and pepper in their pocket, right? Oh, my goodness. And then let's see. She says she has one more. She's going to share one more. This is a, a lid. Just the lid, guys. All right. She said, okay. Sorry. Just one more. Out for my morning walk on Saturday. And apparently my neighborhood was having a yearly neighborhood garage sale. Who knew? I purchased $120 worth of vintage Barbie stuff, listed her and sold in 24 hours, paid for the whole purchase and doubled my money. Everything else is listed. Took a best offer of $272. They were all in for $305.58 shipped. Already have gotten great feedback. Don't be afraid to pay up people. It only hurts for a second. <laughs> it only hurts until you sell it for big money. There it is, guys. She Look at her ear. You see the green? I don't think that comes off. And it still sold for big money. Flippin' Friends. Um, follow Flippin' Friends on whatnot. She has Barbie shows, but she will also educate you as she sells. And she is fabulous. See Japan on the foot. Flippin' Friends and Farm Girl Scavenger Noel, Cat Feelin' Thrifty, and me, Bolo Buddies, all on whatnot. Come see us. Uh, that referral link is down below and check out the list perfectly videos and just check out the description. My referrals and affiliates are down there and they are things I use for my business. And thank you for the support. I appreciate you all and I will see you at the next one. Thanks for watching.